Hello guys, here's Martin and welcome in Lightroom tutorial. Today I'm gonna show you how to create perfect black and white image using just few simple steps. So I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. I don't wanna talk too much so I start. At first I need to change my image to black and white so click black and white. And then we need to increase some colors. I put some red and the most important thing I want to increase orange and yellow color on this image take a look and yellow to add some nice contrast and also I need to put down some blue and purple colors uh, to add some contrast on the clouds it's not too much and okay and then we can go to basic panel and at first we need to add some exposure I think about 0, 060 is ok and then contrast, contrast can be even at 100 it looks really nice then I need to put down some highlights about 70 I think it's okay maybe even 75 and shadows about 75 also I need to add some whites and put down some blacks and okay then you can add some clarity if you like really strong details on your image but I think it looks really nice on black and white image so I put clarity at 100 and it, it looks much better for me so we finished with basic panel then go to tone cure and in tone cure I want to add some contrast so put down the shadows part a little and drag it up on the highlight part and it's all here then you can increase also your details using using sharpening I put sharpen about 90 even uh, but you can do whatever you want and the last step I use to increase uh, my images is just effects go to effects panel and add some amount I think it's a really good idea on every effect so I put amount about only minus 20 it looks okay for me and take a look it's all sorry if I was talking too fast but I think it's easy to understand this tutorial so take a look how it uh, looks before our editing at, and how it looks right now I think it's huge difference and it looks really nice so I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial Thank you for watching, leave a comment if you have any questions or any ideas, whatever you want and see you in the next tutorial. Thank you.